But if you get at the end of June 7th in California and Donald Trump is 50, 70, 100 delegates behind the magic number of 1237, he has hundreds more delegates than Ted Cruz, millions more people have voted for him than voted for Ted Cruz. How do you make the case that he, Donald Trump shouldn't go to the convention well positioned to be the nominee? Well, he's in a decent position to compete for it, but he'll have gotten nowhere near a majority of votes, and he won't have a majority of delegates, and you have to get 50% plus one to win. And he has gotten nowhere near a majority in this contest of people supporting him. And for the last two months, you've heard Senator Cruz what is talk near? about unifying the party. Well, let me just finish this point. Unifying the party and coalescing. All of these other great candidates who've gotten out of the race, uh, the most support has gone to Senator Cruz, not to anybody else. And that's because he's able to unify the party. And that's the kind of person you want leading your party. And that's what we're hoping to do. Uh, when we get to Cleveland. But what is near? I mean, let's say he has 1175, uh, 1220. I mean, at what point is it pretty close that those delegates, the unbound ones, made to avoid a confrontational convention, swing his way? Well, you're asking about individual delegates, and I can't really speak to that, but I will say that until Donald Trump is over 1236, it's game on. And we're going to compete to be the nominee. We're going to compete to get 50% plus one. And we've been on track to do that. As more and more people see and hear Senator Cruz's message, they come back to him. And the delegates who, that we're winning uh, locally across the country are, are coming to that conclusion. A lot of these people used to support Governor Bush or Senator Rubio or Governor Perry or Carly Fiorina. They're coming on board with Senator Cruz. So there's only one candidate really coalescing and unifying the Republican Party, which is a process that okay. really needs to take place if we're going to win in November. Ken, thanks for the time tonight. Good to be with you.